Hey, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. So I've been checking out this LilyGo TTGo T-Watch 2020. We got the unbox and first look video. Also, the previous video, I demonstrated the PictoBlox graphic programming interface installation. Today, I'm going to show you how to prepare the Arduino IDE to work with the T-Watch 2020. So we go to the GitHub site. Make sure to read the instructions and check out some of the comments and issues here. It's got like a little mini forum at the bottom where people are raising specific issues and you can even see what issues have been closed, etc. So it's always worth poking around the GitHub site and getting to know it. You might even want to uh, click the watch button so you get email notifications when there are changes to the site. So they mention here all the examples include a config h file where you define the t-watch model in use and we'll talk about that in detail later on. So here's the install instructions. Download the zip file from GitHub. We'll do that right here. Download zip. And you just want to save it. You don't need to uh, unpack it or anything like that. The Arduino IDE will take care of that for us. You just want to know what folder it's in. And in my case, it's in the downloads folder here. There we go, see? So let's read the next instruction here. It says, in the IDE, click on Sketch, Include Library, Add Zip Library. Sketch, Include Library, Add Zip Library. And now we just need to browse to Downloads and select that zip folder. There we go. Just click open. Now this could take a second because it's going to unpack it into your documents, Arduino's library folder. You also want to follow these instructions for the boards manager. Basically, there's additional URLs to download board manager definitions. And if you haven't done that yet for the ESP32, you're going to want to follow this procedure. And we'll step through that as well. I've done it previously and we'll see that this URL is already in here. Okay, so under File, Preferences, in this additional Board Manager URL box at the bottom, you want a comma-separated URLs here for multiple URLs. So you can see I have the Expressif ESP32 URL there, and I'm just going to double-check and make sure it's correct. Package under bar ESP32 under bar index JSON. Yeah, there's also a dev URL if you want to check out the development version. Okay, so let's check out the instructions. Ah, there's something here about the T-Watch 2019. The T-Watch 2019 is actually this bigger block and it's got multiple boards that you can stack on it. It's pretty interesting. I've got one of those on the way and I'm going to be checking that out soon. So let's look at some of the examples that are available now since we've loaded the examples. So you go File, Examples, and we're going to scroll all the way to the bottom. There you have it at the very bottom, TTGo T-Watch Library. And so all of these examples are available to try out on this TTGo T-Watch 2020. We've followed all the instructions here and we can begin to work with the TTGo T-Watch 2020 in the Arduino IDE and check out some of these examples. But first I want to take a look at that one config h file thing again. We're going to do that in detail. So right here in the TTGo T-Watch library, they talk about every example includes a config h file. And for the first time use, you need to define the T-Watch model. So let's go into the file system. Remember I said it's under Documents, Arduino, Libraries. And then we'll see the TTGo T-Watch library. There it is, TTGo T-Watch library master. Here's the examples. And let's just pick an example. Here's digital clock, we'll go with that. And there's the config h file. And we really just need to find the line that has the model of the watch that we want and clear the two slashes in front to uncomment that line and then save it. So we're going to go with the LilyGo Watch 2020 V1, clear those two slashes and then save it. And then it includes the LilyGo Watch H that has all of the features that are selected by that definition. 
Okay, so stay tuned because we're ready to start checking out some of these examples for the TTGO T-Watch 2020. Give this video a like, click down below for the links in the description, click up here to subscribe, and click over here to check out the TTGO playlist. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching Shotoku Tech. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share.